I want to take a second and talk to you guys about evangelism. You know, our church, if you came first time to our church, I hope one thing you get from our church is our main goal, our main purpose of our church is to win souls and make disciples. That's what Jesus came to save and seek that which was lost. And this is the main goal of our church is people that do not know Jesus. We're going to do everything we can in our power and strength doesn't matter if they're Hispanic, Black, American, any culture everybody needs Jesus and that's why we do anything from school of leaders to our home groups we make our church in such a way that when a Christian person comes to this place person that does not know Jesus he can feel comfortable and he can listen and receive the salvation the good news of the gospel amen I want to read one scripture from Mark chapter 16 verse 15 and Jesus says, go into all the world and preach the good news to everyone. Amen. This is the foundation of our church. You know, I want to read the scripture, but I want to insert your life into it. The way I want to read it is, that go into your world and preach the good news. Amen. I was yesterday a dentist. Yeah, the struggle was real. <laughs> I'm not going to lie to you, dentist is not one of them. The people I like to see I have every six months I go for cleaning and when I show up I give them the look they're like uh oh <laughs> but anyways I mean I, I always find it funny dentists they uh, stick two hands in your mouth they stick some rubber block they got a vacuum and a hose there and they try to have a conversation with you <laughs> I always I always thought it was funny I'm like how in the world am I supposed to answer you I'm like <laughs> But anyways, I was sitting there, honestly, and uh, I don't know how, but I remember at the end of the appointment, I left, and I invited the dentist, the girl that holds the hose and vacuum, and I gave them cards, and it kind of hit me. This verse hit me that, go into your world. Are you a teacher? Are you a truck driver? Doesn't matter where you're at. I mean, in my car, I have uh, our church cards there. Every time I go by... The coffee lady's like, what you doing? I'm like, I'm going to church. Here's the card. They don't even ask me now. They're like, are you going to church? I'm like, yeah. So I encourage you, you know, evangelism happens when it doesn't happen. In a sense, I mean that it happens when you don't think it happens. It happens when you live your life normally. You go day by day. You see your people. You see your homies and cronies. You do life together and evangelism is not an event it's a lifestyle amen so I encourage you as you go through Monday Tuesday Wednesday your week live with a purpose live with the calling you know there's a difference between calling and career our calling all the Christians have same calling is to win souls and make disciples your career could be a truck driver dentist whatever we use our career to pursue and fulfill our calling amen amen so with that I want to encourage you next Wednesday our team is coming from uh, Mexico and they're going to have amazing testimonies to share bring a friend don't come alone I always when I when I come to your church or Wednesday service I never come without calling or sending a text without you know inviting somebody amen because somebody needs to hear the good news